Welcome to this short video on how to test for clay, uh, sorry, test for lead in your terracotta pot. Um, hopefully you've seen this uh, tandoori oven I made before. i uh, got lots of feedback on, regarding this and someone asked me the question, are you worried about lead in your pot and cooking? And no I'm not, but it does put that thought in the back of your head. So I bought a, a lead testing kit. These are quite easy to get in, hold of in uh, the US, not so easy in the UK. But simply to test it, you got an, an activator and a, and a swab. So if I just put this in here, whoops, get the solution on the, the swab, and then I put it inside here, and I run this on, put it against a, a cut I've made in the pot. So we just cut a hot chunk in the surface, put the activated solution on there, and then we hold it here for 30 seconds and then we see what there, if there's any lead in the pot. So if we just wait here for 30 seconds. Okay, 30 seconds is up. And if you look at the swab, everything's like crystal clear. Now, if there was lead in the pot, this would be uh, yellow. More lead, it would be brown. And even more lead, it would be black. And there's one more test we can do. So that's quite a simple test, no lead. Next test we can do is what we call a, a leach test. And what we're going to do here is actually to see if there's any if any lead leaches out of the pot. So I'm going to take the, the top from the other one, which I cut off before, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some vinegar on the, on the surface here. Now I'm going to leave that there for another four to six hours, uh, and the whole point of the vinegar will try and leach out any lead in the terracotta. And I do the same test again. This time I'm going to use my test tube. I put my swad, put it in there, so I put the liquid in there, the swab, shake it around and see if we've got any lead. So I'll see you in about four to six hours. Thank you. Okay, eight, um, it was six hours ago I did my initial uh, leaching test. So we had plenty of time to leach out any uh, lead. So let's see what the tests are. So, first of all, soak up the fluid. I'll put in my test tube. Next I get my um, swab and my activator solution again, once again, get the activation, I'll drop that in the test tube, put the lid on, give it a little shake, once again I have to leave this for 1 or 30 seconds, so just bear with me a minute while we do this. Okay, 30 seconds is now up, and as you can see, once again, crystal clear. Now, just remind yourself, if there was a lead, or lead had leached out of this terracotta pot, that would either turn a, a light yellow for a small amount of lead, a brown or darker brown for more lead, or black if there's a lot of lead. So as you can see there, it's like crystal, crystal clear. So, just remind ourselves, what we've done is, from this lead testing kit, we've scraped a, a chunk out of the pot from the inside and we did the swab test no sign of lead we then did a leach test so we had the vinegar sitting in the, the terracotta trying to draw out any lead from the terracotta pot so I had that running like that for six hours and once again put it in the test tube tested it and no lead so I can safely say there is no lead in my terracotta pot so I've got no worries of doing any um, tandoori cooking so I hope it's been useful for you and any queries just uh, ping me on the website or, um, or ask a question on the YouTube video. No, thanks. Thanks a lot.